guys, Ryan Bidoff here in a beautiful day in Chiang Mai, Thailand. There we go, a little more perspective. Man, I am so deeply honored. Little old me was asked to do an interview on brand.com. Anytime you get into that website where the URL is a branded name, you get the drill. I really feel tremendously honored and humbled by the experience. So, you know, I've answered the questions and I'm not sure when it's going to be published. But how did I do it? Five reasons why brand.com wants to interview with little old me. Number one, I decided to start branding. How about that? For the longest time, I traveled the world and I really didn't integrate into my blog. A confidence issue, maybe results. I wasn't a gazillionaire already in my mind, so I'm thinking, you know, well, should I do it? And then as I opened up over the course of time and let my self-conscious and my limiting belief blocks dissolve, then things started coming together. I came in touch with two awesome designers, Amal Rafiq from Aleppi, India. That's it. And Phil Dews from England. Philip Dews, that is. And I really feel grateful because they helped me craft my blog so where I felt confident putting out those travel pictures and really making it into a branding machine. So that's number one. Number two, wow. I network like a champion. I really network like a machine. I meet as many people as I can each day, do interviews, guest posts, accept guest posts, social network stuff. The more people you meet, the more you're going to have a chance to land really big time interviews. Number three, create like a machine. You have to be inspiring to get interviewed by one of these people. And I didn't do it by just posting once a day and holding back five to seven times a day or more some days. A couple months ago, I was doing insane stuff, or actually last summer when I was in Costa Rica, you know, 30 times a day. Wasn't the best strategy, but it was all about testing my limits. Yeah, I was really posted 25 to 30 times a day. Go back into my archives and you'll see most of our video posts, but I was really doing that. Number four, wow, how did I land an interview on brand.com, an upcoming interview? I was nice. I believe in karma. If you're nice to people and if you simply put out good karma and you brand yourself the right way, people are going to notice you people in high places and that's how I got three guest posts on ProBlogger. Brand.com asked me for an interview. Zach Johnson, the awesome and powerful and talented Zach Johnson at Blogging Tips, another Jersey guy, asked me for an interview over there. And you know, it's just really humbling experience again to have these things line up. And number five, how did I land an interview on Brand.com? I persisted like hell. Guys, my life has not been easy. Don't ever for a second look at me and see me smiling and think that I didn't have to go through hell. Click on my About Me page. Check out my story on my blog. You'll see it. I really went through some deep, dark times. But I truly believe that God brings us through these times to make us more infinitely powerful than we could believe. It's just a wise thing I heard from Sai Baba. Or is it Sai Baba? One Indian mystic. He said, we're all God in disguise, it's just I realize it. What's the life in you but God? The more you start realizing that, you'll persist like a beast through any situation. Guys, I love you. I appreciate you. Please comment below. Let's chat. And also, do you have any tips or any reasons why you landed authority interviews or any interview? Because an interview is an authority interview. If somebody wants you to share your thoughts, that's a pretty special thing, no matter where it is. Also, retweet this post, share on Twitter, Facebook, stumble upon LinkedIn, Google+. Give it a thumbs up on Blog Engage. I really appreciate your support. Got to hit the pool, guys, here in Chiang Mai. Appreciate it, guys. We will chat soon.